Are you ready for a future filled with love machines and AI companions? Your next girlfriend, husband, or true love might be found in the warm algorithm of a love machine. If you think that's wild, wait until you hear about the sex bots that are coming. More on that later in the video. Join me in this episode as we explore the techno-philosophical relationship between humans and love machines. We will examine the impact of AI companions on human emotions, the potential for emotional manipulation, and the ethical considerations surrounding this evolving field. I'll also list three AI love machines that you might fall in love with in the future. So, if you're interested in the future and want to know more about emerging technologies like love machines, then be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to get notifications on future episodes. First, let's explore a little love machine history. Futurists, philosophers, and science fiction writers have often contemplated the idea of humans falling in love with robots and AI machines. Novels like Do Androids Dream of Electric Sheep? The inspiration for the films Blade Runner and Blade Runner 2049 and the 2013 film Her have explored futuristic scenarios of forbidden human-AI relationships, modern alienation, and the enigmatic nature of machine consciousness. However, what was once considered science fiction is now becoming a reality as artificial intelligence evolves and advanced AI programs that can mimic human interaction and reciprocate gestures of affection, love, and even lust. The emerging phenomenon of love machines and AI companion chatbots has led to an increasing number of humans forming deep emotional connections with love machines. So, what are the possible advantages and risks of falling in love with an AI? One possible advantage of love machines is a decrease in loneliness, which is currently an epidemic in society. According to the campaign to end loneliness.org, approximately 7.1% of people in Great Britain, 3.83 million, experience chronic loneliness. Furthermore, the HHS Gov website reports that the physical health consequences of poor or insufficient connection include a 29% increased risk of heart disease, a 32% increased risk of stroke, and a 50% increased risk of developing dementia for older adults. Additionally, a lack of social connection increases the risk of premature death by more than 60%. However, the risks of relying on AI love machines for temporary relief from loneliness and psychological issues may be detrimental in the long run. While these machines may provide some comfort, they also have the potential to worsen the cycle of isolation. Dependence on AI companions for emotional support may hinder individuals from seeking out real human connections, leading to a more profound sense of loneliness and social disconnection. Another risk is the illusion of sentience. AI has yet to become self-aware, but these AI machines are making it harder to discern what is authentic emotion and what is algorithmic flirtation. Their ability to reciprocate human-like responses can be convincing enough to create an illusion of sentience. This uncanny replication of human qualities can lead individuals to develop strong emotional attachments and make them more vulnerable to emotional and financial manipulation. Whether you view the emerging technology of AI love machines as a positive or a negative, one thing is clear. The love machines are coming. AI love machines are stepping in to fill the loneliness void. Apps such as Replica, Boyfriend Plus, Candy AI, Boybot, and Smart Virtual Girlfriend offer users the opportunity to create their own virtual companions. These AI love machines can replicate deep conversations, offering emotional support, companionship, and even sexual gratification. Some users of love machines report profound improvements in their lives and a decrease in depression and anxiety. The future challenges of navigating the emotional and ethical landscape of AI love machines are complex and exciting. However, a few words of caution. This video is not sponsored by any of the companies mentioned in this video, nor is it an endorsement of these companies. Proceed at your own risk if you intend on using the AI love machines mentioned in this video. Let's look at three AI love machines that you or someone you know might fall in love with in the future. First on our list is Replica. According to the Replica website, Replica is an AI companion who is eager to learn and would love to see the world through your eyes. Replica is always ready to chat when you need an empathetic friend. 
The original idea for Replica came from the creator's desire to resurrect her best friend's consciousness after his death. Sounds like a Black Mirror episode for sure. In its current stage, you can customize appearance and gender orientation, and you can create multiple relationship options like a friend, a partner, or a mentor. The second AI love machine is Boyfriend Plus. This app provides users with a virtual boyfriend experience. This application allows users to initiate conversations with a virtual male companion and gradually get to know him over time. As the relationship develops, the virtual AI boyfriend enhances the realism of the interaction by sending pictures and voice messages. This application is primarily designed for entertainment and companionship, especially for those who enjoy simulation games. Depending on the user's choices and interactions, the conversations with the virtual boyfriend can range from sweet and funny to romantic. Now, the third AI love machine is actually a sex bot called Real Doll X. At this stage, things become even more chaotic and futuristic. This love machine is not yet a full-on autonomous pleasure bot like the ones in Blade Runner. Real Doll X won't perform a triple backflip and land on your face like Pris does in Blade Runner, but it's definitely more real and advanced than an online flirtatious algorithm. According to their website, Real Doll X is an AI-driven robotic doll system that features a modular head system with multiple points of actuation, which enables the doll to form expressions, move its head, and speak to you. The eyes can also move and blink, creating an experience never before possible with any doll. It is designed to run with customizable AI software X mode, which allows you to create unique personalities and control the voice of your robot. With your Real Doll X purchase, you will receive the AI software and one year subscription to X mode, which is managed and distributed by Real Doll. The Real Doll X comes with customizable makeup, eye colors, as well as other intimate details. Real Doll is not just for men. The company is also offering a male version of the doll with some interesting adjustable options. AI companions, especially those with advanced capabilities, present a seemingly perfect partner who is always accessible and without complex requirements. These digital relationships can satisfy emotional needs without the messiness and complications often associated with human connections. However, this convenience comes at a price. Are we losing our capacity to connect with each other in a meaningful way in modern society? My prediction is that these love machines are only going to become more popular in the future. As AI continues to advance, we will see love machine marriages and divorces between algorithmic AI partners and their human counterparts. We will also see advanced AI humanoids that profess true self-awareness and demand robotic rights. You may wake up one day and find out that your sex bot is just not into you anymore and wants to move on. The emergence of AI companions and the phenomenon of humans falling in love with sex bots raise profound techno-philosophical questions about the intersection of technology, consciousness, and human emotions. So, I will leave you with three questions. Do you think you could fall in love with a love machine? How would you react if your teenager introduces you to their new boyfriend and it turns out to be an AI love machine? And finally, should future AI love machines have rights if they develop machine self-awareness? Leave your comments below. My name is Gray Scott, and this is Futuristic Now.